The premise of Bullet Train revolves around Wolf's wedding, but why was Ladybug there? In his action comedy from 2022, Brad Pitt plays a hitman who returns to the field and encounters a number of mistakes. This includes the wolf, Bad Bunny, running into Ladybug on the train, but the film also reveals that this is not the first time they have run into each other. Ladybug attended Wolf's wedding, which turned into a tragic event when all of the guests unexpectedly passed away. After Bullet Train shows the wolf's bloody wedding that sets him on a quest for revenge, the movie does briefly show that Ladybug was in attendance. He infiltrated the wedding and posed as a waiter, which is when he accidentally bumped into the wolf and spilled wine on his jacket. Bullet Train also confirms that Brad Pitt's character was not the one responsible for killing all these people in David Leitch's movie. However, it is never explained why Ladybug was at the wolf's wedding in the first place, leaving it as one of the movie's big unanswered questions. Possible reasons for Ladybug being at the wolf's wedding, El Saguaro is the only explanation offered for Ladybug's attendance at the wolf's wedding in Bullet Train. The wolf reveals that the killer who killed him also killed his wife, but Ladybug is unaware of the killer's identity. His handler Maria, Sandra Bullock, doesn't reveal El Saguaro is the cartel boss who attended the wolf's wedding until after he has spoken to her. She suggests that El Saguaro might have been Ladybug's intended victim and the cause for his intrusion into the wedding festivities. Maria might have ordered Ladybug to kill the cartel boss there, given her immediate memory of his presence at Ladybug's former mission. Even if El Saguaro was the target, it appears that Brad Pitt's bullet train protagonist Ladybug might have been in the dark about his assignment. He may have been the backup plan to take out El Saguaro and others at the wolf's wedding if Hornet's methods failed. This would indicate some level of cooperation between Ladybug and Hornet's handlers to pull off this plan. However, it is also possible that they were sent to kill El Saguaro individually, and it was only after Hornet's poison started to take effect that Ladybug left the wolf's wedding to not get involved in the aftermath. Ladybug being at the wolf's wedding makes Bullet Train's mythology deeper, although the reason Ladybug attended the wolf's wedding may not be revealed until the conclusion of Bullet Train, the history between the characters cleverly adds to the assassin mythos of the film. It is one of many ways the featured characters are related in terms of their motivations and backstories. The world of the film is connected thanks to Bullet Train, which may be advantageous for any sequels or spin-offs. It creates a framework so that later characters and tasks can connect to both Ladybug's past and the wider world.